Hello there, Scorpio, and welcome back for another video, and happy birthday, Scorpio, as well. And many, 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 many more awesome birthdays or born days to come, okay? So today, Scorpio, is all about your person here. Whoever your person is, we're pulling their sexual energy towards you. How do they feel about you sexually? You could be with this person. You could not be. I don't know. It really doesn't matter. We're just pulling the sexual energy from your person. Now, whoever this shows up in this reading is the person energy that stood out the most, I guess, for you, Scorpio, okay? <laughs> uh, thank you so much to all of my subscribers. I really do appreciate your positive energy and your support because by liking my channel, subscribing, and even leaving me comments, it really does help my algorithms and it helps my channel to grow. So thank you guys so much. Now, Scorpio, I've pulled one card from my Romance Angel Oracle deck, the top and the bottom, to get the overall energy of your person's sexual energy towards you, how they're feeling about you. And befitting, I pulled six cards from my regular tarot of sexual magic because we're pulling the sexual energy. Sexual energy, how befitting to use sexual magic tarot. So, Scorpio, my darling, Scorpio, my birthday, Scorpio. Now, your person, Scorpio, was coming up in passion here. You see that? Passion. It says, allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. So, your person has extreme, extreme, extreme passion for you, Scorpio. Your person is... <laughs> Your person has so much passion for you, Scorpio. And you see this person where it says passion. This person has on wings. So I feel like this person feels passion for you spiritually as well as physically. This person just feels you. It's like this person is connected to you passionately. So the card underneath the bottom of the deck, we have honeymoon here. It says enjoy the bliss of holiday time together. I feel like this is your birthday season, Scorpio. It's also holiday season. I feel like your person wants some alone time with you. Your person may want to take you away uh, to celebrate with you because they want you all to themselves. But not only do they want you all to themselves, they have a lot of passion with you, Scorpio, that they're trying to explore with you. So this could be someone who you may have not even had sex with, but this person it show feeling you sexually. So your person's first card is the Eight of Swords here. This is air energy, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius here. This person is in a mental funk with you in their mind, Scorpio. This person is stuck. stuck. This person's movement is, is stagnant. It's, this person feels entrapped because you are so on their mind. But you're just not just regularly on this man. I feel like it's... it's uh, obsessive this this is obsessive here because this person cannot this person can't even see themselves functioning unless they get you sexually because they because of the passion that they have for you scorpio now underneath this eight of swords here guess what we have we have the devil here see that so you could be dealing with the capricorn here scorpio now this capricorn here this devil energy now you see what this capricorn this this devil is holding in his hand I don't know why he's holding his dick in his hands, a very big dick at that. But it's as if this person is trying to give you, this person has so much passion, they want to give you they dick so bad, Scorpio. <laughs> They're so turned on by you that they want to give you they dick, okay? But being that this is the devil card here, I feel like this person is trying to trap you some kind of way. So I feel like this person is trying to do something sexually I feel like this person wants to perform some type of sexual magic on you to bind you here because this person is obsessed about having sex with you, Scorpio, because they have so much passion. This passion is about to dry their ass insane over you, Scorpio. Um, but this is a person that's trying to bind. This person's trying to trap you, Scorpio. So next to your Eight of Swords here, Scorpio, you have the Hermit card. So you have a Virgo energy here. Now, if you look at this picture here, um, you see this picture here? This person is introspecting, but this person is thinking about you with other people, and this person can't handle it. This person does not want you to be with anyone else sexually or any other way, but especially sexually. So I feel like this person has dropped off. This person has been doing some things. This person had to introspect to come up with ideas or come up with a way to get you out of this 
energy where you're entertaining other people. Your person don't want you with nobody else, Scorpio. They go on the same just the thought. That's why they're in this eight of swords energy because they feel like they got to get you. They got to get you all to themselves. They're so obsessed with you. So this person can't even think straight because they feel like they don't even want to even visualize you with someone else. And maybe they've even saw you, but it's messing them up because they don't want to share you. They want you all to themselves. Now, underneath the hermit card, we have judgment here. Now, this could be um, rebirth. It could be uh, reconciliation, healing. Um, but I feel like, you know, this is karma also. I feel like your person is trying to set their intentions because this is like a for sure, th this judgment energy. Now, remember, your person was in hermit mode. Your person had to introspect. Your person was thinking about something. Your person was seeking answers to find out how they can get you away from your other pursuers because they don't want you with nobody else. Remember, your person is obsessing over you. They're in this devil energy here. So I feel like your person here is trying to figure out a way how to get you. I feel like your person is trying to bind you. Your person is so obsessed that they would do anything they have to do just to get you in their life so they can have you sexually. Because like I said, this devil walking around with his big dick in his hand. I don't know what that's about. But this is something that they're trying to give you. This is all they've been thinking about. Because remember, crown of the devil, we have the eight of swords. This person is stuck in their head. This person about to go crazy, Scorpio. So judgment is them hoping. Judgment is them being confident enough that, uh, you know, they're positive enough that, Whatever conclusion they come up with is going to work and it's going to get exactly what they want. Now, next to the Hermit card, we have the Page of, of, of Cups here. If you look at this Page of Cups here, this is water and just uh, the Pisces, but it's water, Cancer, and Scorpio here. And you look at this picture. This person, the Page is our messenger. This person wants to message you something, but this person is having a hard time expressing themselves. And I feel like this person is extremely moody. This person, you see this black cat, this person went off on a deep end. Because here this person go obsessing about who they think Scorpio with. Look at that moon. Look at that couple back there. This person about to go crazy. So this person, I feel like this person wants to reach out and offer you this honeymoon. This person wants to take you away. This person, because they got something in mind for you, Scorpio. This person is de in determined to get you away from everyone else. Because underneath this page of cups, we have the magician. This person is trying to work some type of sex magic on you, Scorpio, to make sure you're not with anyone else because this person is obsessing over you. This person is trying to, so whatever this, I feel like this person wants to take you away. I feel like if you got, if you have sex with this person, they're going to dress themselves, they're going to dress their dick up so that, so that it kind of binds you to them so they don't have to worry about you entertaining other people and you will always be there, Scorpio, so... This is how I feel. This is what the cards say. It could be a Capricorn because this Capricorn, this devil energy is standing out the most. This Capricorn is standing out the most. And if you look at this Eight of Swords in the background of this, it's the same hind. This person standing on hind legs, so that's the devil too. This person is obsessing. This Eight of Swords can't move, restricted, feeling like you're trapped. This person feel like they can't do anything until they get you in their life. It's that devil energy. So this person is so obsessed with you, they're willing to work love magic on you just to get you Scorpio. So Scorpio, this has been your reading for how your person looks at you or how does your person feel about you sexually, Scorpio. So if this video resonates with you, Scorpio, please like, share, subscribe, and leave me a comment. Happy birthday, Scorpio, and I will talk to you on the next video. Bye.